Nearing the end of its seventh week, the Occupy Wall Street protests have sparked several other similar protests, including some here in Tippecanoe County. News Channel 18's Alex Dyro joined up with protesters in Lafayette to ask them how their protest differs from those in other cities. She has more on our top story. As Occupy protests continue across the nation, a small faction of concerned citizens took to the streets of Lafayette today to have their voices heard as well. This is what democracy looks like! I think we need to show the people of Lafayette that, yeah, there's people in this population that feel exactly the same way they do, and we're angry enough to go out in the streets and use our voices to say it. The entire Jones family, Sammy the dog included, took to the streets of Lafayette to express their anger at government bailouts and what they view as unbalanced taxation. My husband and I are both gainfully employed. We have really good jobs and we are angry that our money goes to corporate welfare. We are angry that, they, that the rate we're taxed at is twice the rate of capital gains, which is the primary income of billionaires. Why should we pay a greater portion of our income in taxes than a billionaire does? It's outrageous. Though the Lafayette group will not be occupying public spaces anytime soon, Participants say they do feel their views align with the Occupy groups from larger cities, and they're pushing for a change in the way government money is spent. So we're just heading down this very, very slippery slope that we may not ever be able to climb back out of. It's time for people to get out and try to wake people up because it can't be the same as it's always been. We cannot keep spending half of our resources on the military. Andrew Bubrick feels it's just as important to bring the message to smaller cities like Lafayette. The kind of change that will be necessary at the federal level in order to fix all of those things that I just said won't happen until this entire country gets out in the streets. Not everyone agrees with the Occupy mentality, though there have been quite a few comments about this protest on our Facebook page as well as on our website. Many say they do not agree with the concept. Keep the conversation going on our webpage, WLFI.com. Alex Dyro, News Channel 18.